I'm in a wheelchair. I have to learn what I can and can't do. I have MS and I would say that the MS got worse. The main thing I do is evaluate homes um, in order to make them more accessible for folks with a disability. Bonnie's bathroom door originally was only 24 inches wide, um, that wide. I like to do things with my hands because my legs don't work very good. I like to make jewelry, make bracelets. Multiple sclerosis is a very progressive disease and the last, um, I would say every year, it has gotten um, harder to deal with. Our uh, training in rehabilitation, our background, um, gives us a unique perspective about um, disability and its function on uh, accessibility and its impact on uh, a person's daily function in their homes. I called um, my um, caseworker and she said well we can do um, the process of just you know changing the bathroom in, in a way to help me and so that's why she had called Easter Seals and then I talked to all the people that were in Easter Seals. There was a closet behind here uh, which forced her to have to park out here in the hallway and her caregiver to lift her up and carry her in. They did it all and they, it, it was just, they were so nice and I, I felt just very comfortable with them and talking to them about what I needed and then they set it all up. Once you entered, there was a large sink, uh, vanity sink here. The bathroom is so much easier because that was always the hard part of me getting ready to do anything with was the bathroom. A typical wheelchair is going to be 30, uh, 32 inches wide. You're, you're not going to be able to fit through here. There's just no way. This helps so much more for my family. The difference between the 17 inches that she had before and 45 inches now. Very nice, very professional, and they they told me everything that they were doing every day. It's just so much easier for my aides and myself to get in the bathroom to take a shower. The toilet was over here next to what was a bathtub, um, and so there really was no space to get past the toilet and into the tub. Trying to um, just be able to, as much as, much as I can, do things without my aids. Even though Bonnie has use of her hands, um, yeah. she has trouble with some some finer uh, motions. And so installing this installing this uh, type of sink, where it's a touch on and a touch off sink, was another helpful feature for Bonnie, so that she doesn't have to adjust it and get the temperature just right. They pretty much did everything as far as the you know shower and how to get in um, on a flat surface so I could get my shower chair in. This is a rolling shower chair. Um, she, Bonnie still requires the assistance of a caregiver to get in and out. If anybody wanted to, um, something to do in their home to make their, their life easier, I would definitely say that Easter Seals is a great place to start to go and just talk to these people. They're just nice.